Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new to my channel, my name is Gafi, and today we are going to be doing an unboxing and try on for my Stitch Fix box. Stitch Fix is an online service that helps build a wardrobe that's personalized for your lifestyle. That works is really easy. You just go online, fill out a style quiz. This quiz creates a style profile that fits your style, your fit, and your price range, which also helps Stitch Fix match you with the perfect stylist. Once that's complete, you can schedule your fix with a $20 styling fee that gets credited towards anything you decide to purchase. Now the fun part, you get to try everything on at home, decide on which items you want to keep and which items you want to send back. All exchanges and shipping is free of charge. Stitch Fix also offers a 25% buy all discount. Anyway, enough of me talking, let's unbox my Stitch Fix. Unbox the box, super excited. If you're like me and you can't wait to see what your stylist is sending to you, as soon as you get an email confirmation saying that your Stitch Fix box has been shipped, you can easily see the styles that are sent to you. If you go in the app, click on the Your Fix icons. Right at the bottom, there's a clickable icon there that says Check Out. So if you click that, you can already see the summary of the items you're gonna receive and get really excited to receive them. <laughs> anyway, if you open your box, it looks like this inside. And this is your prepaid bag to return the items you want to send back. This is what my packet looks like. And then you also get your envelope. You have your invoice sheet and a calculation of your 25% buy all discount if you decide to buy everything with these perforated style cards that show all the pieces you have and how to style them if you needed any help with that. Of course, a little note from your stylist. Happy fix date, gay fee, and welcome to fix number 34. I hope this fix finds you well and enjoying the changing seasons. Do you typically see a lot of extra rains in your part of Washington this time of year? I got your note about looking for more spring styles as well as for some more basic staples. I'm happy to be able to send this fortune and ivy knit cold shoulder dress that has the perfect combination of ruffle spring and fun and how does that how does it fit and feel you can pair this dress with a denim jacket and white sneakers or dress it up with strappy sandals and a top knot for a date night the olive velvet by Graham and Spencer V neck top is one you'll find in your closet easily and will pair it well with endless styles. The democracy curve phrase step hem jeans have that unique touch I know you like. Have fun with this fix. Cheers, Casey. Yay, so excited. First piece I have here is a top by Graham and Spencer in the color olive, size small, retailing for $88. This is cute. It's got a really interesting texture to the fabric. Next is this dress from Fortune Ivy. This one is in the color burgundy, size small, and retailing for $54. Really cute, excited to try this on. Here is another top, and this one is by Threads for Thought. The color beige, size small, retailing for $34. This is Definitely what I'm looking for. A pair of jeans from Democracy. Gray tone, size too petite, retailing for $78. This feels nice. And it does have a really unique frayed raw hem here, which is really pretty. Top from Free People Movement in the color pink, size small, retailing for $78. This looks like a fun hoodie. Okay, those are all my pieces. I'm super excited to try them on. I am gonna go and clean up a little bit here. I'll be right back. All right, so here's the first outfit, and this is the pair of Democracy jeans. I love the fit of this. I love the color. I love this gray wash to it. It's really comfy. The one thing I love about Democracy jeans is that it has this elastic waist to it, which is super comfortable, and it gives you some movability to it when you're moving around throughout the day. Super soft pair of jeans. It's not like an itchy or harder denim fabric, but just really soft. I do love the raw hem to this. It's really interesting because the front is a little shorter than the back, and I love the way that this shapes my butt. To be honest, if you look in the back, there is some stitching up here that kind of curves around and it really does make it more flattering in the back. So I really love this pair. This is a really nice, good quality pair. And then second here is this Free People Movement Pullover. I am loving the color of this. It's got a bubble sleeve going on here, um, but it's really nice, comfortable, good quality piece. You can see that there's like this striped, stretchy detail at the bottom. 
it is cropped and then it has a hood to it with a really low v-neck there's no drawstring to this um, so it just goes kind of all the way around to the back let me show you guys good size hood kind of big like it's pretty good size hood there um, but I really love this and I love that it has like a low neckline here and you can wear it with jeans again this is just a very, very nice basic hoodie but overall outfit I am just loving this whole outfit here super cute just paired it with some cute pink fashion sneakers Guys, so here's the next piece. I'm still wearing the same Democracy jeans, but this is the blouse from Graham and Spencer. And it's a really cute top, definitely a basic that you can wear all throughout the season. It's got a cut right now that is very on trend. This is like the length of it here with some side slits as well, where it's a little bit longer in the back. And of course, it's just really cute. For me personally, I love to tuck these pieces in. I'll pair this outfit with some low cut booties and some accessories and just really cute. It's a really nice light fabric and it's got almost like a kind of like a gauzy kind of braided gauzy material to it which is really nice. This top also gives me like free people vibes. It has that same kind of quality to it, same kind of fabric that's used in a lot of free people outfits and pieces um, but this is a really nice olive tone super cute and just a really nice outfit together as well Alright guys, so here's the next piece and this is the Maggie T from Threads for Thought and I love this tee. It's got a raw hem at the cut here and then also on the sleeves. You can see it's a really thin fabric so I am a little worried about how this is going to be after it washes. I'm almost worried that this will shrink or I'm not too sure how this is going to look after it washes if it's still going to look the same or if it's going to keep its shape very much so I am worried a little bit about that. It's a really nice tee to wear when it's really warm out. It's still breathable and it's just very comfy. I love the cut of this shirt. It's just like a cropped fit but like has that boxy shape to it which I like with this like little pocket here but I do love the raw hem detail all around on the sleeve and I love the tone of this I love beige I've been loving the beige tones lately and I feel like this is something that's really popular right now as well going into the warmer weathers but it's just a really nice color especially with these gray democracy jeans um, it's such a simple piece, so I felt like you can just accessorize with something like this. And so I paired it with some jewelry and then also a pair of some studded sandals to kind of just bring the look together and add some pizzazz. It's really cute, edgy, but also feminine outfit for the spring, and I just love this. Alright guys, so here is the last piece. It's a really comfortable dress. I this fabric makes it a really casual piece and definitely an everyday dress which I'm kind of looking for right now. So I'm really loving it. It's got like an A-line shape to the skirt and it also has, come up close, it also has this like little kind of overlapping fabric at the front which is really cute. The ruffles go from the chest middle of the chest area and just over the sh around the shoulders to the back and then it has this spaghetti strap here that is also adjustable which is really nice and it also has like a little bit of stretch to it as well just a really pretty everyday casual dress and um, very comfy and I'm I'm really loving it really loving the fit
Okay, so that is everything in my Stitch Fix box. To narrow everything down, I'm going to start off with the things I'm for sure not going to keep, and that is this piece, this Velvet and Graham Spencer top. This yarn fabric, I'm just okay with. Like, I love the shape of this top. I'm not sure that the fabric is really making the shape of the top fall on me or fit on me the way I personally would like. So for that, I'm just going to send this guy back. The next piece I'm going to be returning is Fortune and Ivy dress. I love this dress. I love so many things about it. I love the fabric. I love the florally detail and the ruffles with the drop shoulder. There are only two things that's keeping me from getting it is that the length, I think it could be a little bit shorter, maybe an inch or two shorter. I wish it was more of a lighter shade, maybe more of a mauve or a green or a pink shade for the spring. This darker maroon color I still feel like it gives me more of a fall vibe so for that I'm gonna pass on this this free people hoodie I love this I just purchased a pinkish peachy hoodie from Abercrombie it's kind of similar to this I really love the pink cropped slouchy fit of this sweater and it is a really nice soft fabric so this one's a maybe for me for now this threads for thought tee I am a little worried about how it washes though but you know the price is around $38 so I'm gonna give it a shot and keep it because I really love the fit and the color of this very simple and it is a very nice basic top that I'm looking for right now so I'm gonna keep this next piece I'm keeping is this democracy jeans of course another pair of jeans but one thing I really love about this is the comfort in these jeans they are just silky soft it has such a nice stretch to them and i am loving the raw hem on this it is really perfect fit on me and that's the reason why i want to keep it i just think it's really nice cut and i can already see what i'd wear it with with some nice lug booties and i do love the look of them with like a really nice cropped raw hem i love the threading in the back it really does make your butt look nice i think in my opinion so for that, I'm going to keep this pair. All right, guys, so that's everything today in my Stitch Fix box. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know which piece was your favorite in the comments down below. I'll make sure to link all the names and sizes of everything in my box in the description box for you, including a link for you to use if you decide you wanted to try out a Stitch Fix box. You and I can both benefit from it, and by all means, it's not something that you have to do but if you did decide to use it it'd be really awesome anyway if you enjoyed this video today please give me a thumbs up and if you haven't yet don't forget to subscribe thanks again so much for joining me in the stitch fix unboxing and try on you guys have a wonderful day and i will see you guys in my next video Bye bye